Hey, and welcome back, fellow fans. I am just cooking up some food. Mmm, mmm. Let's get some more food. Um... Yeah, yeah. Put that on there. Put that on there. Put that in there. Yeah, yeah. Mmm. Delicious. Looking delicious here. Does this burn? Well, I'm sure this burns. Let's go ahead and cook this as well. <clears throat> I have so many fences. Do saplings burn? Well, I'm almost done cooking here. Delicious. Mmm. 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 Got some delicious. Mmm. Look at that. Delicious. Delicious meat. Oh, what was that? And look at that fire! Ah, oh, look at that fire. <laughs> Uh, I didn't actually know about that, but apparently, the, uh, fuel source shows up on the bottom there. That's new to me. I didn't know that. Anyways, welcome back, fellow fans. Let's make it day. Welcome to Let's Mod Millionaire, the Inuits. It's been a little while. It's been a little while. But, uh, we are having a fire pit update. The fire pit can finally replace the furnaces. Let me just go ahead and delete some files here. The uh, fire pit can finally replace the furnaces, which is needed because the furnaces requires stone. <laughs> and the Inuits don't really have a way to access stone, except for going to the player, and that's just, that's just annoying. No thanks. No thanks. So I'm just cleaning out my exports here because we need to make some new exports. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's just turn off the fan. It's it's really hot, but uh but I think you guys can hear that. So, uh, as was seen before, I don't think I actually did... Did I do some changes? Oh, and the... Huh. What? The Inuits have their own way of making cauldrons now. Out of bone. So I'm going to throw some of that in here. Don't know why I didn't. We were going to make them bone colored, but that just didn't look good. Plus, there's no need to do a whole thing just for a small thing like that. Not really needed. Not really needed. So let's go ahead and export you. <clears throat> Export you. Getting a bit of lag when I do that. Interesting. And export you. I left the door open. Ugh, I left the door open. Let's just go ahead and delete that. Close the door. I did a few other changes, like uh, paths and whatnot. I don't know if I did it to this building here. But, uh, oh, 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 and there's one more. Ah, here we go. Here's why it was all odd. Let's go ahead and remove the second one. Okay, we got some cauldrons over here, a fire pit here. Uh, I was wondering why it was so barren. 
in a fire pit right there. And a fire pit right there. How about somewhere right there? So there and there, and there and there. There and there. There and there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So yeah, here are the bone blocks. I would have made the cauldron be retextured like this. Maybe would have changed the inside bit. No, no. Because the top of it looks pretty great for that. Yeah, yeah. That would have worked just fine. Anyways, I deleted the second one, right? <clears throat> yes, yes. A2 is deleted. Let's go ahead and... This should only be on one. Because if someone chops down the tree, I don't want it to grow again. I left the door open. Oh, man, we're not even on. We're not even done with the first one. Did I leave the door open here? I did. Come on. Close those doors. Okay. Um, A2, delete, and export. And export. Okay. <clears throat> now we have that. What do we got here? Ah, uh, the armory. I believe I did some changes to this one as well. Don't remember. <laughs> I had some computer problems. Horrible computer problems. And it's been a, a week or two since I worked on these buildings. I just finished off the last ones in the row. Get rid of those. Why is there only one chest there? I don't like that. One chest. Okay, so we did the first one. What? Army one, zero, one. We did the first two. Now for number two. Now for number three, let's check on that chest thing. Oh, oh, one of the new villager zombies. Hello. Hmm. I like how they have their own uh, nasally growl now. So I'm going to export this, and every time it goes up to this version of the of the building. There will be a zombie villager. No, I'm just kidding. That'd be cool. That'd be cool if it worked like that. But no, no, sadly no. So we got, what do we got here? I don't think I did too many changes to the carver. Uh, if you guys haven't been paying attention, due to popular demand, the carver's initial building is uh, whale, uh, whale bone because the carver's who makes the snow bricks. Um, we got the carver one and the carver two. Not much excitement here. Not much excitement here. What do we got here? Ah, the food preparer. This was a fun one. I did change the food preparer because I did not like the open tops. Uh, that that weird castle -y vibe thing. I made these vent things. I think these vent things are a lot more appropriate. And let's just go ahead and delete that because the doors were left open. You're the food preparer. 
Have some more. Whoa, whoa, what? There we go. What is going on here? Why is that so far out? Yeah, it's so far out on all of them. What? Why is it this wide? Let's just lessen that width a bit. Yeah, there's no need for it to be that wide. I have no idea why it is. So that will make it forget this line. So let's go ahead and delete the food preparer and re-export that. Enthralling footage, I know. One. To who? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Why? Why is it expected to be nine? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's still eight. What is going on here? Delete. Let's try that again. Export. Export. <sighs> Six, seven, eight, nine. So it's not that. It's definitely this. It's definitely this. Why? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Delete. Export. Okay, it says length 8. It says length 8 right here in the code. <clears throat> what about here? Are you blanking kidding me? No, there isn't. Okay, okay. How about this? Wait, that says food preparer, right? What if I delete that? Really? Huh. I thought I archived some old files in another folder, but it still looked at the other folder. Well, oops. Anyways, uh, one, a two, a three. Oh, no. Three. There we go. Uh, uh, all this is really frying my head. Oh, oh, I don't know if I mentioned this on camera, but the upgraded version of Millionaire Dev has the preserved ground block looking like sand with dirt in it. Because it preserves whatever's underneath it. And usually that is supposed to be sand or dirt. I mean, sometimes it can be stone. It, it will accept stone if stone's underneath it. But the intended use is for in deserts, for it to be sand, and for anywhere else, for it to be dirt. 
It looks nicer. It looks nicer. Okay, so where are we? This was the guest house. The red block means I didn't make any changes to it. This is the hunter. I don't know if these bones were here before, but that's to signify the wolf spawners. Two beds. Hmm. A little small. Really? It goes there? What if I also did a... No. No. Okay, sure. No changes to the to the hunter. What about the lake? Ah, uh, yes. I don't think I made any changes to the lake. Hmm. What? Why is there no fishing spots? Oh, that's because this is before the fishermen. Also, uh, I spoke with the dev and the snow source blocks. That's what these are. Snow source blocks. Ice source blocks. The snow source blocks are going to be this. That's what it's going to look like. So if it snows, it'll cover it up and you won't be able to tell the difference. Anyways, I think I wanted to make a change to this. I'll be right back. And we're back. I didn't want to do any changes to this building because I'm not sure how that will affect the sub-building of the fisherman house. But I did fix the uh, depth of the lake, as you can see down there. I made it deeper. There we go. For some reason, at one point, the depth got messed up. So here it is. It's fixed. Nice. So there's that. Oh, got some cow spawners here. The cow spawners have apparently been drastically reduced due to complaints. Apparently. Hmm. I don't know. Whatever. Um. So lumbermen. I don't think I made any changes to this guy, did I? He's still super small house. Oh, I don't think that was on the top before. It's certainly on the top now. The lumberman is <clears throat> the only igloo. I believe it's the only igloo that has a door. Because he's a lumberman. He'll make himself a door. Oh, excuse me. The only snow igloo. And... Three. Okay. What do we have here? Ah, the market. I made no changes to the market. Did I? Did I make no changes? What is that? Oh, God. Okay, I'm making changes to the market right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, and I brought the ceiling down right here. I think I wanted to bring it down everywhere. Why didn't I? I 
Uh, I think I was concerned about the lighting. Which is a good thing to be concerned about, because, yeah, that is concerning. <clears throat> but it does look a little better. Hmm. Hmm. Emphasis on little. Oh, and I threw in some beds. Just in case someone here feels like sleeping. Just in case. Hmm. 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 Yeah, I do like that. Okay, nice. Where is the sign? Ah, right here. So, market one. Market two. Yes. <clears throat> Market two. I can never find the signs afterwards. No, no. It has to be the last corner I checked. And there's no sign here. Why is there no sign here? And three. Because these ceiling things are just dumb. These holes in the ceiling, meh, meh. What if I... There we are. Three. Three! Okay. Now, I did remake the offering. And then, so did Zoe. I think he used wood for some reason. But I'm going to have to use the wood one because... I can't have them using stone. What is this? Oh, oh. I can't have them using stone. Except for the player building. Which this is the original offering area. This is how it originally looked. No, I'm not going to change any of the player buildings. Player buildings are done. They are done. Uh -huh. Player housing. 
and the shaman. Okay, okay. Well, let's... Oh, oh, oh. That's because it doesn't understand flowing water. But I think that's okay. Because it, once it ex, once it uh, imports the not flowing water, it all should flow. Right in a chicken. Where is the door? See? Good, good. Okay. Here's the door. Sure, sure. Okay, so. That is good. That is good. How about Shaman 2? Which I also made some minor alterations to, so I have to export it and add to the main uh, set. Shaman 3... Um, what did I do over here? Nothing. And next is the solder, which I kept messing up because it's just a big pile of, uh, a big pile of dirt. It's a big pile of dirt. Although it shouldn't be as hard as it was. So here is solder 1. Solder 2. Solder 3. And I put these on here with these X marks to remind me not to use that one because solder four is here. People were concerned that the solder was going to be too easy to upgrade, so I changed it to coarse dirt and the and that I will need to craft that. Lovely little cozy house. Oh. oh, this is so nice and warm. Look at how warm this is going to be. Nice. You know what? Let's make it warmer. Oh, oh man, that's going to be even warmer. I should give him a chimney. I don't like how that looks. I may consider it. I may come back and give him that chimney, but uh, uh, yeah, yeah. So, solder, solder. We are done with the solder. What do we have next? Ah, the town halls are next. I did a lot of fun changes to the community council building. For one, I made it one less wide and one less long. See right here, I got rid of this one, and there was one right here too, but but yeah, yeah. And people were complaining about the torches that were melting the ice so that the fishermen could fish.
so I got rid of the torches, I guess. I don't I don't understand that. They need to fish. Also, for some reason, I had all the beds in the crafting building. So I moved all the beds over to this building. Oh, and snow path. Ah, I love this snow path. Great path. So let's go ahead and export a one. Oh, and of course the cow spawners. A two. A three. A four. <clears throat> Five, six, could not find the, oh yes, yes, I had to remove it for this because I accidentally almost destroyed my solder. Okay, six. Darn doors open. Come on. Well, let's check it out. Nice, nice. Nice and comfy. Um, what was this? Council is what I called it. Council five. So, six. Doors, doors are closed. And a seven. Something fun. So the Inuits use snow path, which then gets turned into dirt path because you've walked into the snow so much. Something fun is what I did right, where is it? Here? Here. Where it's partial snow, partial dirt. Because it's not been turned into dirt yet. That's a fun one. I like that. I like that. Um, so next we have, I believe, the shamanistic. Shamanistic. Let's get you going. Let's get you going. Oh, come on. You. 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 And I did change quite a bit here. And you. Especially here. I did not like how it looked before. But I think it looks much better now. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, that looks so shaman-y. So nice and shaman -y. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should move that back one. I'll move that back one. Uh, shamanistic, shamanistic. Here, delete. And uh, let's re-export that. I don't like using the birch doors because they look like screen doors. But sometimes I just got to have birch doors. Ah, the tannery. The first Inuit building crafted. Built? The first Inuit building built. It has gone through many changes over the years. And I think where it's at now is a good final stage for to not get too many changes after. Let's go and check out the insides. Here's the classic chimney. This is the only stone in the Inuits, the only intended stone. I threw the fire pit there. <laughs> I think I think that's that's gonna be fun right there. I threw down some more fire pits. At least I thought I did. Did I not? Why is there no fire pits in here? I swear I put fire pits in the other ones. 
Good thing I looked. One, two, one, two. Okay. Good thing I looked. What are you? Shelter. Oh, okay. That reminds me, I wanted to throw down some snow sources. Oh. Uh. Okay, okay, okay. Snow sources. Let's see. Entrance is right there. So let's put... Just so that there is some places for people to gather snow in every village. If I have it on the townhouse, it'll be in every village. But that means I'm going to have to re-export it all. Of course. Okay, okay. Tannery. Tannery. No, no, three is enough. Let's make it day. Okay, um, let's see here, tannery, delete, shamanistic, delete, shamanistic, delete, there we go. Okay, let's go ahead and re-export all that. Okay, so there should be six. Six. Good. Now, those of you who are paying attention will notice that there are two new houses. Two new houses. People were saying that the Inuits are far too easy to upgrade. And that they could use some more buildings. How many we got? How many we got? Six. Perfect. And we could use some more buildings. So I made these two home buildings. These are homes. We've got the armorer house. <laughs> I based that off of the player igloo. And the food prep house. Beep, beep. Food prep house one. Food prep house two. I put beep, beep because I put the, I exported a shape and then I imported it on each stage, and then I just made the changes. Food prep house three. So just four different styles. What do we got here? Armorer house. Nothing. Armorer house one one
Why nothing? What's going on? Armorer House 2. No idea. Okay, sure. Armorer House 3. And we got a nice little house. Apparently no torches. Why are there no torches in here? And no fire pits. Well, there's a fire pit right there. And two torches! Uh. And two more torches! Okay, okay. So that's the pattern. Hmm. What do we got here? We got double chest, workbench, workbench, double chest. Double chest, workbench, workbench, double chest. Let's change you. No real need for that. Double chest, workbench, workbench, chest. Again, okay. Nice fires by the beds to keep you warm. The torches are weird. I must have forgot to finish this one. Okay, so that is apparently needed. Double chest, workbench, workbench, double chest. Bed, bed. Okay, there we are. Hmm. Missing on these ones. Well, they're new. <laughs> I didn't really have them finished, apparently. Okay. Armor House. One. Two. The door is open. Armorer House. Delete. Tahu. Three. Three. Okay. Okay, so what's going on over here? Ah, the food preparer house. I left a chimney on this guy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. One bed. One bed. Where is my head at? Giving him one bed. Okay, so the door opens up here. Let's do a double bed. Mm -hmm. No cauldrons. This is not where you cook. Do not cook in here. This is your home. Home should be beds.
Throw one of those in there. Okay, okay. Bed, bed, fire pit. Sure, sure, sure. What's going on with the doors here? Oh, I remember now. This is the late. This is the last one, but uh, I messed up the order. So here's the final. Nice, nice. Here's the second to last. Ooh, what was that? Oh no, it's just really dark wood. And done with that. Oh, no. Okay. No chimney in this. And here's the first. Ooh. Only two beds in this one. Oh. No beds? One, two, three, in. One, two, three, in. One, two, three. One, two, fire pit. One, two. Really? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay. So good. We have at least one one bed here. Now I need a sleeping position. This tells people to sleep here. Let's see what it looks like on the last one. Mm -hmm. It's double wide. Okay. Okay, so how are we on torches? Two right there. Oh, that can't be good. What's it look like over here? It'll make the torches fall. Okay, so three in, four out, three in, one, two, three, four out, two, three, it's right here. Not good.
Floor torches. Floor torches. Floor torches. <laughs> I can't believe that that attaches to that. Hilarious. Floor torches. Okay, now we can finally export this and get that beta going. When is that beta going to come out? Mm-mm, mm-mm. That open beta needs to come out pretty soon. Three, four. Okay, there we go. Well, thanks for watching. Bye, fellow fans.